But aren't you going to introduce us? Dwayne and Playboy X. Good riddance with Playboy X. I'm just enjoying my apartment. <laughs> Reminiscing about the last hit I did on Playboy X. Which got me the apartment. <laughs> Alright, um, bam bam bam. Look at that. Muscle cars. I'm gonna take this one. And, uh, let me see. I'm gonna drive up here. And after that, I'm going to Packy. Packy McCree. Because I think he has, has a dangerous mission for us. That's why I'm uh, going to the weapon store first. I'll spare you the trip to the weapon store. And uh, I start recording again when I'm uh, done buying a, a bulletproof vest or armor. Whatever you want to call it. And I'll drive to Bucky. All right, guys. See you there. And there we are. As you can see, you have my armor. I uh, bought some ammo too for the assault rifle. My SMG was good, fine. Couldn't buy any more ammo for it. And now we'll visit Bucky. Sorry, Jacob, I'm busy right now. I can't at the moment. Come on. Let us see... Harboring a grudge. All I'm saying is that we'll all be judged in the end. All of your brothers. And you, Patrick. And you, Kate. Who's gonna judge Kate? What would she win if they did, Virgin of the Year? Oh. I'm thinking maybe you can catch VD for both Fuck of us, you, Patrick. Fuck you, Katie. Language. Sorry, Ma. Ho oh, ho, there he is. Mr. Fucking Crazy Man. You want a beer? No. Good. Cause I ain't fucking got none. Very funny. Maybe if being a drunkard doesn't work out, you can be a comedian. Fuck off. <laughs> and you, Kate, fuck off out of here. But aren't you going to introduce us? Sure. This is Nico. Some drug dealing to fucking generate from some armpit in Eastern Europe. That's my ma. Nice to meet you. Hi. And this is my sister. Lovely lass, scared to bits of life. And fucking off out of here right now before I throw a fucking bottle at her. Patrick. Nice to meet you. Likewise. See you around. Bye. What a girl. I think she likes you. Word to the wise, though, she don't put out. Which is convenient, because if she did, I'd have to kill you. Understood. Good lad. You got any drugs on you, boy? No. Shit. Well, probably a good thing. We got some business to take care of. Come on. Or do we? Well, what kind of business? We got business out at the docks in Algonquin. Okay. Where's your car, man? We need a car. I guess we'll take this car. Okay, there's a ship coming in and we're the welcoming party. Who are we welcoming and what have they got that makes this drive worth the effort? We're welcoming some of our cousins from the east, but we don't know what it is that they're bringing in. Exactly. All we know is that it's worth a dollar or two. My brother Gerald had word about it through this Italian, Ray Bacino. He gave us the heads up in exchange for a cut of the haul. What makes you think that the information is legit? 
First off, I don't trust this guinea for a second. We wouldn't be working for him if our family still had the same status it did back in the day. But that's another story. Am I going to hear this story? Anyone who hangs around my family hears about the old days. Just wait. Oh, yeah. Ray Vecino's a slimy motherfucker. The one thing you can rely on him for is greed. I'm too small time to be worth setting up, so the one angle he can be playing is the cash one. Makes sense. Yeah, he'll probably try to give us a fraction of whatever this stuff's worth, but it'll be a fun night. Depends on what you think is fun. A stealing, gunfire, car chases, all the usual stuff. Usual for you and me, maybe. The general population, I'm not so sure. General population? That's a prison term. You ever been inside? Not in this country. In Europe. They do things different there. Not so much of the fun in the shower that you guys have here in America. Must have been a real disappointment. Ok. <risos> Look at this. Look ma. And then tricks. Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? <risos> Wee! Uh. All right. Can we get out? <risos> Okay, another car. That was funny. <laughs> Come on, Patrick. Bet a guy like you thought he was gonna be real popular with the lifers. Did no one pay you any attention? As I said, the whole prison bitch thing is an American phenomenon. It don't happen on the other side of the ocean. Well, you gotta do some time over here. See what you've been missing out on in your chased European jails. I'm going to pass on that. Send me a postcard if you do some time. Will do. Might even put you on the visitors list. I'd be fucking touched. You'd be touched if you did some time, that's for sure. We would see if they'd be able to touch me. I got some moves. You're a good man, Nico. I like you. Not in a fun in the showers kind of way. You know, a male bonding about to go rob some people kind of way. I think I know what you're saying. I have no idea what you guys are talking about. <laughs> All right. All right, here we are. What's the plan? We get up on the roof of that warehouse. There should be a good view of the dock so we can scope that shit out. Stick to me, man. Ah, this is a fun uh, mission. We learn how to climb. These are the things you cannot do in GTA 5. The following this scene. Way. This you, you can do? Show us, Becky. Show us what you can do in GTA 4 and not in GTA 5. You better be right about this shipment. If it's just fish, I'm gonna be pretty irritated, Becky. <laughs> a bit elaborate but it works Up. and again yeah this is how you climb in GTA 4 This is where the deal's meant to be going down. All right. And here's the boat, right on time. Fuck. See those boxes on the back of the boat? They must be bringing clone meds. Meds? Yeah, stuff that'll stop housewives cutting their wrists and make their husbands get wood. Meds. Molly, sedatives, antidepressants, meds. Meds. Okay, how do we do it? We'll wait until the truck is loaded, then we'll take it. Simple as that. Simple, huh? I'll cover you from up here, while you're down on the ground cleaning up. These better be some good fucking pills. The housewives better be grateful. <laughs> hmm. 
Why should I? You gotta jump down there to get at him, man. Well, could also do it up here. What else do we got? It's not a gangster. Mm. Sneaky bastard, eh? Should I throw a grenade? I'm 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 just thinking about it. Let's try. <laughs> Love it. Throw a grenade on the truck. I saw the truck burning. Shit, we nearly had it. <laughs> that was a fucking screw up if I ever saw one. How? Stay around, Nico. It was stupid. Nah. How? How is that possible? That that was stupid. We've got business out at the docks in Algonquin. Isn't Where's there a car, different man? car? We need a car. I'm gonna take this car. It's the same car. Jerry's had word from Ray Bacino, well, his Italian contact. About yeah. a big shipment coming in near the fish market. Ooh, ooh, Triads are wait, expecting uh, something. Hold on, it's... Becky. We've been through that. <laughs> I'll skip the let's play to the uh, well to the action again. So see you guys there. And we're back. Okay, different approach. No grenades. <laughs> but I could... Do this! Most of them from a distance, which I like better. in Yeah. 
so... Anything else? Just go and pick up ammo. That's it. That's it. Alrighty then. Let's get the truck. Yes. That went well. Come on, back. Pexy. Pex. Pexter. <laughs> Alright, Nico, you drive. I'll take out anyone who tries to follow us. We're going up to Ray's lockup in Westminster off of Union Drive West. Alright. There we go. E. cola. Deliciously, deliciously <laughs> infectious. Deliciously. What? Smacked a lot bigger assholes than you. Shit, they go. These cocksuckers are all over us. I thought you had the luck of the Irish. I fucking do. This is we got your fucking Slavic driving skills as well. That's where we're gonna get out of this fucking jam. Put your foot down, man. What the hell? <laughs> Is it Chinese New Year already? There's a box of grenades. Don't get up when I fucking Pass put you down. Peggy. I'll give them a taste of their own fireworks. Bye-bye. <laughs> Have a good time! This is fun! <laughs> Bye! Look at the bullet holes! Lovely! Good luck with that. Yeah. There we go. Ah, this was fun. Classic packing mission. <laughs> Lots of action. Lots of shooting. Ah, and a mobster. The stuff all in there. Sure is. Stuff all in there. Whole truckload of it. A lot of wives and mistresses are gonna be happy when their men get all the hold huh? Whole city's gonna be hard in a few days time. Yeah, but the bing, but the boom. Who's this? <coughs> That's my boy Nico. He's an absolute savior. Couldn't have done it without him. Nico, come over here. Look at the door. You work for these mick bastards. Fuck it, Kenny. I work for whoever's paying. I might give you a call sometime. <laughs> get in, Packy. Hey. I'll catch you around, man. Late. The door is freaking out <laughs> on the background. So, how's the door now? Still freaking out? Well, a bit. Just a little bit. <laughs> oh, this was... Uh, a strange uh, let's play. <laughs> First at the car accident. Where I uh, turned a car on its side and we could make rounds with it. And that uh, fail with the grenade suddenly explodes the truck. W what does Mallory want? Nico. I think He owed them money? He never told me anything. I heard they took him to a warehouse off Long Park and Bohan Industrial. I'll check it out. Hmm. Hostile negotiation. 
Well, that's for another time. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, I love this one. This was an excellent, excellent mission. I love the Peckies one. I guess that's Dimitri telling, uh, telling us he has Roman. Well, anyway, guys, that's for another Let's Play. So see you in the next one. Thanks for watching and dropping by. Appreciate it. You guys have a good one. And see you all latest. Bye.